Channel 3 Early Warning Weather with meteorologist Mark Dixon. Right, with the snow over and the sun coming out, all winter weather advisories, any sort of alerts that we had across the region have come to an end. And we've got lots of great pictures coming in, showing not only the snow, but as well the blue sky. This is a scene coming in from Torrington. Thank you to Sharon for sending this one in. Also from uh, Dorothy in Bolton, showing the clearing trend underway with uh, four to five inches of fresh snow there on the ground. And also into West Haven, uh, Nina sending this picture via Twitter, uh, showing the uh, the snow really picturesque, clinging to all the, uh, the limbs and the trees there making for uh, just a beautiful start this morning and this afternoon of course seeing a lot of sunshine and the snowfall totals a few more to bring you here uh, near five inches from Union Harwington five also four and a half Manchester around three inches uh, officially at uh, Bradley International Airport three inches also from West Haven and Madison at uh, two and a half inches so uh, early warning pinpoint Doppler again showing that uh, the state is now void of snow it has come to an end clearing is uh, underway but temperatures are running below average uh, we're in the upper 20s to low 30s and Inland, so at or below freezing across interior Connecticut between 30 and 35 right now along the 95 corridor. There's a bit of a west northwesterly breeze, nothing too terribly strong, but when it's up, it makes it feel just a bit chillier. We've got wind chill values in many communities in the mid and upper 20s. So dress and plan accordingly. If you're going to be spending any time outdoors this afternoon, doing a little shoveling to clear your, your driveway or your sidewalk. You can see the breeze there moving the flag around as we check out the scene live from Torrington. Uh, clearing trend certainly underway uh, in Hartford, looking east over the Connecticut River. Uh, you can see uh, the, the snow covered green there in the Elm City of New Haven with clearing taking place overhead and uh, southeastern Connecticut a little bit cloudier as uh, the clouds are clearing from west to east. So eventually you will see some sunshine temperatures today top out in the mid 30s inland mid and upper 30s along the 95 corridor. So there goes the snow and with it the cloud cover will enjoy uh, mainly dry conditions for the rest of today tonight and into the day tomorrow. We've got a reinforcing shot of some colder air heading in our direction with a front just off to our west. It will pass through with little fanfare, just some clouds, but uh, tomorrow even chillier than today. They're going to be watching a storm system that's going to be approaching as we head into the upcoming weekend. So um, as we look at future cast the rest of today, again, uh, here comes that front off to our northwest coming through Connecticut tonight, sending temperatures again a bit chillier tomorrow than what we're looking at for today. But tomorrow won't be as breezy and we'll see a partly to mostly sunny sky uh, for our Thursday. Let's fast forward though into uh, Friday. We'll start the day perhaps with some limited sunshine clouds generally will be on the increase tomorrow night into Friday morning. As we head toward the evening commute time, you see the greens here actually can't rule out a little bit of a wintry mix at the onset, but temperatures will be steady if not rising Friday night into early Saturday morning. And that's as a storm system moves in, bringing some steady at times heavy rain to the state starting around daybreak Saturday uh, before tapering off late in the day on Saturday uh, to just some scattered showers. We could see an inch, perhaps two inches of rain across the state. Uh, so that's how things are looking again for the first half of the weekend. Sunday uh, behind that system windy and trending a little bit cooler with highs back in the 40s. Next week starts off on a quiet and dry note. Then another system moves in as we head toward Tuesday temperatures then in the 30s and low 40s. So perhaps a little wintry mix or some rain will keep you updated on that. But uh, this upcoming system after tomorrow again a dry day with sunshine. Late Friday, any mix goes over to rain. This is going to be primarily wet one for us with temperatures on Saturday reaching or exceeding the 50 degree mark.